I think the train is gone. Okay, so today we have Tom Waits and Looking for the Heart of Saturday Night. So the last time and the only time I've ever reacted to Tom Waits was, I think, in 2021, so a couple, a few years ago now. And um, people have always commented and, you know, talked about how I should react to more of him than they hope that I have, you know, listened to him in my private life since then. But I really haven't. Um, Tom Waits is one of the, you know, most universally loved and uh, lauded people have ever come across and it's just like i don't know it, it's such an ambitious endeavor i feel like and it's just like i hope i want to get everything right when i listen to a tom waits song anyway that's just what goes on in my big head so let's get into this talk about it after three minutes 53 seconds uh i did see some longer videos but this is the song i think that's you know the the, the known one so anyway let's get into it and talk about it after <laughs> Pockets are jingling and you see the lights You get all tingling cause you're cruising with a six and You're looking for the heart of Saturday night And then you comb your hair You shave your face Trying to wipe out every trace Of all the other days in a week, you know that this will be the Saturday you're reaching your peak, stopping on the red, you're going on the green, cause tonight will be like nothing you've ever seen, and you're barreling down the boulevard, you're looking for the heart of Saturday night, tell me is it the crack of the pool ball? Phone's ringing at your second cousin. Is it the balmy to smile in the corner of her eye? Magic or the melancholy tearing your eye? The exit kind of quiver down in the cold. Cause you're dreaming of them Saturdays that came before, and now you're stumbling. You're stumbling onto the heart. Saturday night You gassed her up and you're behind the wheel With your arm around your sweet one Your old mobile Barreling down the boulevard You're looking for the heart of Saturday night Is it the crack of the pool balls Neon buzzing Telephones ringing at your second cousin, and the barmaid is smiling in the corner of her eye. The magic of the melancholy tearing your eye makes it kind of special down in the cold. And you're dreaming of them Saturdays that came before it's found you stumbling. Stumbling onto the heart of Saturday night And you're stumbling Stumbling onto the heart of Saturday night Joseph, my goodness, <laughs> Tom Waits looking for the heart of Saturday night. Um, so like I said, I don't know why it's taking me so long to come back to Tom Waits and now another video is playing and it scared me. Okay, but anyway, I don't know why it's taking me so long to come back to Tom Waits with a voice like that, with a style like that, 
with a mood like that. I mean, I saw a comment here. I can't, you know, steal it. Um, and somebody was talking about Tom Waits doesn't create songs. He creates moods. And, um, yeah, obviously, this is just such a moody um, nostalgic song. I mean, that's one word also that comes to mind. Uh, and and like I said off the top too, I always feel coming into a, a I don't know, not a big artist, I guess it is, or an artist that people love and that is, you know, well requested. I always feel like, you know, again, I gotta, I gotta do it right. I gotta react to a song right and all this stuff. And here I have to say, it seems like the song is pretty straightforward. I mean, you're talking about a Saturday night um, and looking, the anticipation, looking forward to a Saturday night. And it makes me think about all the songs that have been, you know, made, so, and songs have been made about every week of uh, every day of the week. I can't talk, but of course, there's you know looking forward to the weekend. There's always those songs you know talking about Saturday, talking about Sunday, talking about the weekend, and just the anticipation into the weekend because usually. Um, you do a nine to five, you know, uh, five days a week during the week, whatever. But some people work on the weekend like I do and stuff. But anyway, sometimes, you know, I work on Saturday, but I know what he's talking about here. Cause I think back to when I was a child, um, and just, you know, when you're in school or whatever, and then finally the weekend comes and you sleep in on Saturday and, you know, you go to wherever, I'm, you know, you go to Tim Hortons in the morning with your father. Anyway, just these things that happen usually on a Saturday, these traditions that happen usually on a Saturday on the weekend when everyone's usually off and don't have to work or whatever, you know, this all comes to my head. But, um, yeah, and anyway, Tom Waits delivers it, obviously, this feeling, this nostalgic feeling. Um, it's such a relatable, um, you know, like I said, he has such a gravelly voice, of course. Uh, it's just like, it's, it's so deep, it's so resonant. Uh, resonant? I, I forget how to say the word. Anyway, and it's just so calming as well, and it's just such a slow tempo here. You got the double bass. I think there's only three people on the song, including Tom. Um, and of course, Tom Waits is on vocals and guitar here. You had some hand claps in there too, which maybe what, that was Tom. Um, Jim Hughart, Hughart is on double bass. Uh, and what you get in the double bass here was obviously very prominent. I said at one point, you know, you just hear that double bass. Uh, and again, the, the instruments here were sparse. And that's, you know, what I love about the whole song. That's what really created such a intimate feeling with Tom Waits. It sounded like, you know, he was right in my room with me. I mean, my God. Anyway, and then Jim Gordon on percussion. Jim Gordon, a guy that I, I, I can't escape. He's in every song <laughs> that I listen to almost all the time. Um, he was in that uh, 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 Nilsson, one of Nilsson's songs, uh, Harry Nilsson's songs. Um, I know he's worked with the Beach Boys, who I love, and just, I don't know, yeah, Jim Gordon's been in a lot of goddamn songs, but uh, anyway, and good for him. But uh, yeah, it's just a name that I'll always remember now. But yeah, anyway, Tom, just the way he delivers this uh, so sweetly, talking about and again i think about back if 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 you're older i mean i think about my dad or my mom whatever who lived during these days you know back here in like 19 when this was released in 74 it says here october 15th 74 uh this song was released that's what uh, genius.com is telling me but um you know who lived in the 70s who lived in the 80s even uh just back in these days i think of uh, uh the cityscapes of those days what the nightlife was like and uh and yeah and that's just, uh, obviously i didn't live that but i think about those times and what, you know, people who are older than me must think about when they hear a song like this, when they hear Tom talk about this and talk about putting your arm around your, your lady and your Oldsmobile and just going down, you know, going downtown on a Saturday night. And of course, again, you must get such great uh, memories from that. Uh, you must feel some sort of, you know, warmth come to you. And again, Tom is just so good at uh, evoking that, uh, getting that emotion out of you and making you feel like you're, you know, you're back in your youth and all that stuff. So anyway, it's just what a great, you know, performance, what a great singer something on my leg anyway uh so i guess you know that's all i have to say at the top from the song again the percussion's great the double bass is great uh they're both very kind of subdued um but at the same time prominent at some points but again tom waits voice just you know just cuts through every everything because it's just such a growly i don't know, gravelly whatever voice and it's just like you know that's what you gotta focus on but um anyway i really i really enjoyed the music here uh and again very slow very melodic beautiful well you gassed her up behind the wheel. You gassed her up. I love it. Um, with your arm around your sweet one and your Oldsmobile. Barreling down the boulevard. You're looking for the heart of Saturday night. And again, another song that comes to mind is uh, Elton John's, you know, uh, Saturday Night's All Right, whatever. Again, all these songs that have been made about Saturday. I think of Saturday Night by the Misfits. Again, just all these songs come to mind. But of course... Uh, those are different songs than uh, what Tom Waits is doing here. Tom Waits is doing here. Uh, you get paid on Friday. Your pockets are jingling. I know that feeling. I get paid uh, as we speak today when this video comes out. So, I mean, my goodness, my pockets are going to be jingling. At least my bank account is, I guess. You know, now that, that uh, we got different technology back here than uh, the 70s. Anyway, um, then you see the lights and you get all tingling. Oh, my goodness. Because um, you're cruising with a six 
uh, you're looking for the heart of Saturday night. Of course, I feel like, of course, you cruise with a six, a six pack of beer. That's what will come to my mind. Um, again, you're just thinking about all this stuff. You know, you got money in your pocket to buy stuff for you and your, your loved one here. And uh, you got a six as well. I mean, what else could be better? I mean, <laughs> you're driving your Oldsmobile uh, with your girlfriend, wife, whatever, driving down the boulevard on a Saturday night, got nothing else to do, which just feels like such a great time. Um, and again, maybe he's longing for these times. I mean, again, this could be uh, uh, one of those things where maybe he didn't reach that... Um, uh, that dream of the Saturday night, but again, he's thinking back to when he used to be able to. Uh, that also comes to mind. Then you comb your hair, you shave your face, which is kind of nice because I I just shaved and took a shower. Anyway, trying to wipe out every trace of all the other days in the week. <laughs> you know that this will be the Saturday you're reaching your peak. And then again, like I said, does he reach his peak on this Saturday? Who knows? Anyway, but again, you you know you you clean up. I guess you dress nice, whatever. You know, wipe wipe every trace of the other days of the week where you had to work or do whatever. And uh, you know, because Saturday is the port the important day of the week, and uh, we got to look good for that Saturday. And uh, you know, you, and we know that this is the day you'll reach your peak. And either way, this is your fa obviously Saturday is your favorite day in this song. Stopping on the red, you're going you know, on the green because tonight will be like nothing you've ever seen. Again, this this Saturday night Saturday night is going to be like none of the others. Um, and you're barely down the boulevard i just love that too barreling down the boulevard i just think of the old mobile just kind of i guess going speeding or whatever down the boulevard uh you're looking for the heart of this of saturday night uh tell me is it the crack of the pool balls neon buzzing telephones ringing it's your second cousin is it the barmaid smiling from the corner of her eye again this just has such a uh, a bar kind of scene to it you know i think of like a smoky bar i think of all these things that this guy likes to do maybe tom whoever he's talking about in the song what they like to do what they like best about their saturday night what makes it uh you know what will make it their favorite night of the week or will make it uh their peak saturday anyway the magic of the melancholy tear in your eye and again that kind of tear in your eye a tear in your eye almost saying like uh, you know, cause you, you might not ever get another Saturday like this. This might be the best one you've ever had. You get that melancholy tear in your eye, perhaps make it kind of quiver down in the core because you're dreaming of the Saturdays that came before. And now you're stumbling, you're stumbling onto the heart of Saturday night. Again, I get a feeling of maybe those Saturdays, those Saturdays are over. Maybe he's looking back on his best Saturdays. I don't know. That comes to mind here. Anyway, or he could just be talking about how he still loves Saturdays and still uh, parties with his uh, loved one in his old mobile. You gas her up and you're behind the wheel with your arm around your sweet one. So then we have the first verse come back in, barely down the boulevard, and then the bridge one more time, and then the fifth verse, the last verse, I do believe. And it, and this song, too, it's slow and it's, you know, kind of... Um, I guess, again, like I said, melancholic and everything, but he does sing a lot. I mean, he, there's a lot of, uh, you know, five verses here, uh, you know, and one verse is repeated. There's the bridge. Uh, so yeah, he does a lot for kind of a slow tempoed song. Anyway, makes it kind of special down in the core and you're dreaming of them Saturdays that came before it's found you stumbling, stumbling onto the heart of Saturday night and you're stumbling, stumbling onto the heart of Saturday night. Let me let the cat out. But anyway, um, as a, just a whole overall thing, I guess I would say, my goodness, obviously, he just, he loves Saturday. I mean, my goodness, everyone looks forward to the weekend, especially if you work during the weekend, you have Saturday, uh, weekends off, whatever. Um, you throw yourself at the Saturday, at the Saturday night, a day of where, a day where you can do whatever you want in kind of a way. It's your own day, and Sunday, you can do that too. I, you can do that too, I do believe, my goodness. And, um, but yeah, and I think about, again, I, I was talking about the whole stumbling thing. Um, you're stumbling on Saturday night. I do think about how maybe he had a drink or two. Uh, you know, that does come to mind, stumbling into the Saturday night. Because, again, he said he has had uh, his six earlier in the song. So, at this point, maybe he is stumbling. Hopefully, he's not driving. But, anyway, it's just the, uh, I mean, this is just an ode to Saturday night. An ode to the weekend. An ode to the end of the work week. And uh, and just, you know, cleaning up. And uh, going out with your 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 babe, I guess you would say. Whatever. And, uh, and just cruising down the boulevard. And, uh, you know, living your life to the fullest. And uh, not having to worry about anything else. I mean, what a great feeling. What a nostalgic feeling. And, uh, again, the way Tom delivers it is just so good. It's just so relatable. And just so... Uh, warm as well too i mean if his voice is really good i mean obviously and uh, it's a voice that is very memorable it's unique i hate saying the word again but again it, there's no one that really sounds like tom waits he has such a deep 
gravelly growl to him, and um, I love it. So anyway, I got to react to Marv Tom Waits. It's been way too long. I'm an idiot, but uh, anyway, finally got back to him. So there you go. So thanks for the requests for this. I'm glad I finally came back to him. Um, I don't know why, again, it took me so long. But again, there's just, I guess it's just, there's something to Tom Waits where it's like, I don't know what song to pick. Uh, I know this one has been suggested and it's ranked as one of his best, but I, I just feel like he's such an ambitious singer. He has such an eclectic discography, and I didn't know what to do. So anyway, here we finally are. So thanks for watching. <laughs> thanks for liking, subscribing, commenting, all that stuff. Really appreciate all the support. And I'm um, sorry if I stumble over my words here. Um, it is warm in this house, and uh, I don't know. I am tired, but um, I had to get this done. So anyway, thanks again for watching. I'll talk to you guys again soon.